everyone, it's Rochelle here, and this is the makeup look I'm doing for you guys today. And this look was inspired from Rihanna's latest video, Where Have You Been? So I saw the video for the first time yesterday, and yes, I love it. I love her makeup, I love the video, I love the song, and I wanted to try and recreate this look for you guys. Now, throughout the video, she had, I think, um, two to three different makeup looks. This is from the scene where she had short black curly hair, and the brows were like really dramatic. Now, as for the makeup, um, it was a bit dramatic, so it wasn't really a wearable look that you would wear on the street. Um, the brows, um, no. <laughs> and the eyes, maybe yes. Yes, I think you could wear the eyes. Uh, actually, yeah, I would wear the eyes out. So, um, yeah, if you guys want to see how I completed the look, um, keep on watching. Let's begin. So the first thing I'm going to do is actually fill in my brows first. Now in the music video, um, Rihanna's brows, they were a really dark brown shade. Um, I guess that's because her hair was black in the video. So I'm going to darken my brows than I usually would. And the eyeshadows that I'm using to fill in my brows are Run by MAC and also blackout from my Naked 2 palettes. And I'm just mixing the two shadows together. Now I'm using an angle brush to fill in my brows. So I start off by taking very light strokes. Next I'm just going to comb through my brows. And I'm using a mascara one, however, if you have a spoolie, go ahead and use a spoolie. I misplaced my spoolie somewhere and I have no idea where to put it, so I just grabbed a mascara one to do this. Okay, so from the photo that I'm looking at of Rihanna, her brows, she had very dramatic brows, so they kind of had like lines going through them. So I'm going to go ahead and create the same look on the other side. And I'm using Blackout. I'm going to start right here. And I'm taking really gentle strokes with the brush. So I'm not going too harsh with the brush. Next, I'm going to apply primer on my eyelid and this is just going to help my eyeshadow not to crease up and it's gonna last longer throughout the day. So I'm using Urban Decay Primer Potion. Next, I'm going to add a base to my eyelids, and I'm using um, Annabelle Lip Pencil, and this one is Cherry, so it's actually similar to Max Cherry, so it's just a red lip liner. And I'm just using my finger to blend that out. Next, I'm going to apply the eyeshadow Red Brick by MAC and I'm going to apply this in my crease. And I'm just going to apply this in the crease using the MAC 224 brush. So that's a fluffy blending brush. Next, I'm using this bright red eyeshadow from my BH 120 palette. And I'm going to just pat that on. And I'm using an oval blender brush to apply, so you just want to pat that on because you want that pigment to really show up. Next, I'm using a black eye pencil. And I'm applying this to the outer corner of my eye, also along my bottom lash line. I'm also taking this into the crease but not all the way. So you want to stop right in the middle. Next, I'm going back into my Naked 2 palette and I'm grabbing the eyeshadow Blackout. And I'm placing this at the outer corner of my eye. Next, I'm going to go ahead and blend that out using my 217 Crease Blender Brush. So I'm blending it upwards to get that shape that I want. Next, I'm going to go ahead and line my waterline, and I'm using Smolder by MAC. Next, I'm going to go back into the same red eyeshadow from my BH120 palette, 
and I'm applying this along the bottom lash line. Next, I'm taking a facial wipe and I'm just going to wipe this upwards like that. So just to get the same shape we have going on over on the other eye. And I'm just going to reapply the red. Next for my highlight, I'm using the eyeshadow Foxy from my Naked 2 palette. And it's a vanilla shade eyeshadow and it's a matte finish. So I'm going to apply this along the highest point of my brow bone. Next, I'm going to apply some glitter. Okay, so I'm going to wet my brush with my Fix Plus spray. This is just going to make it easier for me to pick up the glitters with. So I'm placing it at the inner corner of my eyes. So I'm applying along the crease as well. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and apply Black Track Fluid Line by MAC. And I'm applying this along my top lash line. And I actually wanna make a very thin line. I don't want it to be too noticeable. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and apply my falsies and I'm gonna apply these off camera and I'll be right back. Okay, so I've already applied my falsies, so I'm just gonna go ahead and apply some mascara to them. And I'm also going to apply mascara on my bottom lashes as well. Okay, so next I'm going to apply Revlon Color Stay Mineral Finishing Powder and it has a bit of shimmer to it. So I'm going to apply this along the highest point of my cheekbones and I'm using a contour brush to apply for my blush I'm using a shade that is two shades darker than my skin tone so for the lips Rihanna had a nude shade lips so the first thing I'm going to do is apply a bit of concealer to my lips Next, I'm going to apply the Lip Pencil Beige by NYX. Next, I'm going to apply a Nude Shade Lipstick by MAC, and this one is Myth. The look is complete, and I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Thank you guys for watching. Bye!